Hi everyone, and welcome to the channel. In this video, we'll be looking at when and how to harvest your peppers for seed saving purposes. Saving seeds is an excellent way to extend the life of your plants and get more value from your garden. I'll be taking seeds from a variety of different peppers to demonstrate for you all how we can get seeds that germinate quickly and efficiently and avoid those seeds that rarely or never germinate. Here I have a small sample of peppers from the same plant. These are snack sized bell peppers, which I've grown here on the channel before. These principles though will apply well to almost all varieties of peppers. The first peppers we'll be looking at are more than fully ripened. They're actually beginning to wilt a bit. These peppers were fully ripe and ready to eat a while ago, but they've remained on the plant. We can see that the skin is beginning to wrinkle and looks a little bit leathery. I'm going to break open this pepper and move the seeds onto a rock wool cube, which I have soaked in water. I'll leave the seeds here to germinate and we'll see which peppers are able to produce the most viable seeds. The second group of peppers we'll be looking at are nice ripe peppers. They've fully turned color and are ready to eat. They have a juicy plump feeling. Again, I'm going to take these seeds out and set them up on a rock wool cube. Lastly, I have a green unripened pepper. Most peppers are juicy and delicious before they are fully ripe and it's easy to harvest early. With a few more days on the plant, this pepper would turn red and be completely ripened. I've spread these seeds out onto my third rock wool cube and now we've got a good comparison of peppers harvested at different times and we'll be able to see which batch of seeds germinates the best. We rejoin these seeds on day number six and we have some seeds that are germinating. Root tails are emerging from the seeds and beginning to extend themselves, but this is only happening with the seeds from our leathery old peppers. The seeds of the ripe and unripened peppers are yet to show any real signs of germinating but almost all of our leather pepper seeds have roots extending already. We join our seeds again on day number 10, and now we have a bunch of small seedlings with their leaves opening up and beginning to extend themselves. Every single seed from our leathery peppers have sprouted, a 100% germination rate. Looking at our comparison seeds though, it's not nearly the same story of success. A few seeds have some signs of small white emerging from their tips, but there's no real roots and it doesn't seem like anything good is happening here. Pretty clear proof that when we're looking to harvest pepper seeds, we need to be patient. We need to leave the peppers on the plant well past when they are ripe and ready to eat. Our leathery old peppers definitely get the trophy here as they're the only peppers to have produced viable seeds. Best of luck to you all with your own pepper seed harvests. I hope this demonstration helps you to stay patient. Thanks for watching and happy harvesting.